Nikki Kirsten, some developing news now out of Cushing. The city is still recovering after the 5.0 magnitude quake caused a lot of structural damage there. Two works for your reporter. Jitzel Puente is live from downtown Cushing with a look at the damage and an update from city officials. Jitzel. Good morning, Daniel Tanaya. There are several buildings in downtown Cushing that look exactly like this, just a pile of bricks and debris, just to give you an idea of how strong that 5.0 quake was last night. The city manager told us about 40 buildings have been damaged on the outside. They're mainly downtown businesses. Also, the city hall building has broken glass in the entrance, and they're trying to get that repaired by tomorrow's election day so people can come out and vote. The city says a structural engineer is going to check the buildings, especially the senior living facility that had to evacuate more than 40 residents. Right now, safety is their main priority. And we'll do some assessments to make sure there's no danger from falling debris. As soon as we get those things taken care of, then we will you know, allow access to downtown, but it could be a day or two. And close to downtown, some buildings at the Cushing Public School District were also damaged. They canceled school today for safety while they assessed the damage. Now, coming up in half an hour, we'll let you know when school officials are thinking uh, students will be uh, able to come back to school. Reporting in Cushing, Jitzel Puente, two works for you.